Hello and welcome to Stock Data Type, Stock Quotes and More. My name is Jeff. I'm glad you're here. Let's just jump right in. Let's say we need to pull some stock quotes right into our Excel workbook. Can we do this? Sure. Uh, we just start by typing in the company's name or ticker symbol. For example, maybe we want uh, Google. Uh, maybe we know the ticker symbol. So for Microsoft, it's MSFT. Um, or maybe we just type in a company name, Disney. Okay. Once we do that, we select the company names or tickers and then we're going to want to go to data and data types and select stocks now this is you know at the time i'm recording this this is a relatively new feature so depending on the version of excel you're using and when you're watching this you may or may not have access to the data types yet um, but when you get it you would just click stocks and excel <laughs> converts these names into the stock data type and, and we get this stock symbol to let us know. Um, and now we're set because we can add related company data, including uh, you know, price, you know, stock quotes, uh, employees, and all kinds of stuff. So before I actually add new data columns, let me just convert this range into a table. Now strictly using the insert table command to convert this to a table isn't necessary, but it's just it's a little easier to work with. Um, so now we just add columns. Okay. We look at this Add Column button, and we click that. Now we have all kinds of related data. So maybe we want to view um, the ticker symbol. Got it. <laughs> maybe we want to view uh, the current price. Got it. Maybe we want to view you know, the previous close. Got it. All right. And you can, um, you, you can check, and, and there's all kinds of fun stuff to play with in here, but, but, but you're set. And then you save the workbook, you close it, and you know tomorrow you open it and you want to, to refresh it. How can we refresh it? No worries. Just head to Data and Refresh All. Okay. Um, alternatively, we could right-click and go to Data Type and Refresh. That would be fine, too. Um, and, and then that pulls in updated prices and, and information. Um, we can also view the card. And so we could select the, um, the little icon, and that gets uh, the card. Uh, which is basically kind of a, a snapshot of all the information that we could add into columns as well. Um, and so that's available um, as well. So anyway, this is a very quick and amazing way to pull stock quotes and related information right into an Excel workbook by using the stocks data type. Hope it helped. Hey, thanks. Have a great day. This video is a production of Excel University.